What's up guys, welcome to my channel and today I'll be giving you a few tips to play my favorite hero right now, Electros. So sorry guys if my voice changes from time to time because I'm having a flu and I'll probably run out of breath after a few words. But as always, I'll try my best to make my speech as clear as possible and if you have any queries, feel free to leave it down in the comment section. Also don't forget to leave a thumbs up if you find the video helpful and subscribe if you want to catch more content like this. So I play him as... A hero that goes around taking out those carries and baiting their opponents to an ambush around me. So what makes Electros my favorite hero right now is because he has powerful crowd control abilities and insane mobility. What makes him even more special than other heroes is that when he is ganking lanes or aiming the carry, he has a control immune ability which supports him in his killing. And it makes it very easy for him to kill almost any carry with that speed, crowd control and control immune. So he's basically like a superpower mosquito that can transmit deadly viruses to anyone and gets away with it. So let's start on our mosquito guy. So tip number one for being the best mosquito is to farm till level 4. This is very crucial for Electros because he doesn't have enough burst damage before level 4 and he might be a free kill to the guy that he aims instead. So farm till level 4. And when Electros reaches level 4, that's when his power spikes, which means it's time for a gang or showdown on your own lane. So go ahead and pick a victim that you want to eat up or destroy. And um, if you have a teammate that has crowd control ability as well, that's very, very useful. If you don't, make sure you know where the enemies are so that you won't get counter gang instead. So now let's talk about his skill adding sequence. And the first skill that you want to add is the speed boost because the other skills won't have any effect without the speed boost. The second skill I'll add is the circular one first from the left which deals damage to surrounding opponents because that means you can hit multiple opponents or minions at a time which is very useful for farming and harassing. The third skill on the extreme right is the passive that stuns on his first basic attack during speed boost which cancels the speed boost if you attack early but deals a massive amount of damage and locks the opponent from running away from you for a short period of time. His ulti deals area damage around him as well and locks the opponent for a short period of time. So can you guess his combo yet? If you guess it right, that's awesome because I'll be giving you more tips. Oops, sorry if I disappointed my friend but uh, stay tuned because I'm giving you more tips for free. Yeah. Okay, I sound so boring with a script, so let's go with our script right now. So firstly, you run like a mad dog and chase the person you want to kill. And then when you find the person you want to kill, stun him. And then use your basic attack once or twice, and when he starts to run away, use your ulti to stop him. And when he tries to dash away or runs away again, use your speed boost because it will be instantly cool down when you use your ulti. And then you need to continue chasing the guy like you're chasing your crush. Chase all the way. And if you get him, don't forget to crush him because he's not really your crush. He's a bastard and makes you drop right now. I mean, I mean um, he's your opponent and you have to kill him in order to up rank and be Paladium. Just like, not me. So now let's talk about team fights. During team fights, you have to aim the carries on your own because your team is weak and your team is weak and your team is weak. So you will have to be the carry and take down the opponent carries before trying to eat up the fat bitches. I mean the tanks. And most of the time, the carries will be at the back. So try and enter from the back and. That will leave your team confused as to which side they should go and if you're in trouble, just run away. But don't run too far because if they decide to aim your team again, you can backstab the carries and be the hero. So to sum it up, basically the way to play Electros is to be like a fly, fast in speed and reaction. 
and super annoying. Okay, so now that you know my secret to playing Electros, I'll leave you to enjoy the video. But don't forget to watch my other video, Top 5 Electros, Carnages and Quadra Kills. Thank you guys so much for watching my videos and I'll see you when you want to see me. Yeah.
invincible.
possible.